Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's Dmitry Davidoff. I'm Bitrix 24 Chief Marketing Officer. And today I will be talking about using Bitrix 24 as an applicant tracking system. This is actually one of the most common scenarios for Bitrix 24 because you know CRM is basically a database. An applicant tracking system is a database as well. Our CRM really doesn't care if you're working with clients or prospects or job seekers. Uh, you can set it up for a number of purposes. We have a lot of people who use Bitrix24 Realtors who use it to sell real estate. And we have a number of um, headhunting agencies that use Bitrix24 CRM as well. And this is the basic setup. So I'm going to set up my uh, resume funnel. Uh, this is very easy to do. I can add a new stage if I want to. I can change color. I can uh, delete any stage that I do not need. And this is my basic setup. So I'm going to have incoming resumes and then I'm going to screen them just to get rid of uh, applications that are obviously not going to work and then I have my first interview final interview offer accepted and then uh, at least that's how the way uh, that's the way it works in my company we do maintain a resume pool of uh, eligible people who we were not able to offer a job but who we believe will uh, be great candidates in the future so this is the setup and again you can create as many stages as you want to. Now the question is how do uh, new resumes come in? Obviously you can add new uh, leads manually if you want to but this is probably not what you want to do. The uh, two most common scenarios and Bitrix24 supports both on the free plan is automatically creating a uh, lead when an email sent to a specific email address for in your instance it's going to be vacancies at mycompany.com or hr at mycompany.com so any email sent to that address including attachments will automatically create a new record then you will receive notification that you've received a new application you will pre-screen it and you know move each lead down this stage or that stage so that's one common scenario another common scenario is a submission via a form and of course in Bitrix24 we give you free forms as well I've created a sample applicant tracking form right here where I can submit resume I can attach uh, uh, resume here I can submit application desired position this is all fully customizable and you know once I do that let me just show you how it works once I do that a submission is automatically created right here if I go to leads this is the uh, Person, did I not? Okay, maybe that's because I've already had a person with this name submitted. Let me receive the notification and yes that's the uh, the submission that I've received the the first time it didn't create because I already had this person with the same name so it automatically merged the second record I'm sorry for confusing you anyway so this is how it works uh, you can add applicant manually 
You can add it automatically when you receive an email to a uh, specific email address or you can automatically add resume to your database, applicant to your database via web form. And those web forms are entirely embeddable. You can embed them in your sites. That's available to you absolutely free of charge. Uh, what is so cool about Bitrix 24 that uh, other applicant tracking systems do not offer? Obviously, right from the CRM, I can send this person email address, excuse me, email messages, and the system will collect all emails in one place. I will have the entire history of email communications with that person stored right here. This is extremely convenient if you have a large HR department or several recruiters. A single glance, you will be able to study the history of previous communications. You can send uh, text messages. That's obviously a very good idea as well. And I can make calls. And the very cool thing about Bitrix 24 phone calls is that you are able to record those calls. And the recording of those calls are stored here as well as MP3 file. So when you do a job interview, the first interview or the second, Usually one person participates in an interview. The other people from your hiring committee, if they have uh, applicable rights for CRM access, they will be able to go inside the record and they will be able to listen to the MP3 file. So that's pretty cool. Uh, very convenient uh, when the entire history of all communications is stored in one place. Let me talk about uh, several features that are available to you as a commercial user. And this is under automa automation rules. Uh, starting with $39 a month. I click configure uh, automation rules and I can, for every single stage, I can uh, add triggers and rules. So for example, I can automatically send an email that will say, if there is an incoming uh, in, uh, in submission, an email will say, thank you very much for applying uh, for this position. You will hear from us shortly. Also, I can set a stage, like let's say I have this stage called declined. I can send automatic decline emails when I, uh, when I, uh, move the applicant from one column into another. So I can send an email. Sorry, you were rejected. <clears throat> and when I save, when I move, let's say, Taisha from here to here, an email will automatically go. So that's very cool. We have a number of other uh, rules available to you as well. For example, I can send uh, text messages automatically if I want to. So I can, uh, when I send a person to the final interview, I can send a text message to his or her phone that says, congratulations, blah, blah, blah. Obviously, uh, there are a number of parts that I'm not covering right now, how to configure automatic lead creation from emails. I did not cover web form creation. I will leave in the comment sections of this video instructions where you can uh, see how it's done. And my recommendation is actually contact your local Bitrix24 partner and have them configure it for you. It's very, very inexpensively and you can actually find uh, a very inexpensive Bitrix24 contractors on freelance or guru.com or uh, Fiverr or upwork.com as well. So if you do not want to get involved uh, in setting up, you can have a person uh, we do recommend Bitrix24 partners uh, to do that for you. 
And I do encourage you to study automation rules. I have a video about that actually in our long CRM training session because everything here can be automated. You can change responsible person for the applicant when a certain rule is met. This is very, very, very advanced. You are able to run advertisement on Facebook, for example. So you can create a Facebook lead form and look for people uh, to apply to your jobs on Facebook. And all the data that is entered on Facebook will automatically uh, be imported uh, from the Facebook lead ad form to your Bitrix24. So uh, I think I've covered the basic overview. It should be sufficient for you to understand uh, how the entire process works. Again, pretty much everything is available to you absolutely free of charge. If you do want automation, if you work with hundreds and hundreds of applications each and every day where you need to use canned replies when a person is accepted or, or when he or she is rejected, uh, we do have also mass mail uh, section here. If you want to uh, send emails to uh, hundreds or thousands of people, this is available to you as well. And this is one of the advantages of using Bitrix24 CRM as an applicant tracking system versus the native applicant tracking systems because they're pretty good at what they do for the HR features, but they do not have nearly as many automation and marketing uh, tools as we have. And sometimes you need to have that outreach uh, especially if you work in a large company where you have a number of recruiters communicating with hundreds of people on a daily basis. Okay, thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, I do encourage you to um, subscribe to our channel. And if you want to share this video with your friends and colleagues, if you want to share it on Facebook or Twitter, feel free to do so. Again, this was Dmitry Davidoff, Bitrix24 Chief Marketing Officer. Bye-bye.